Hello, uh, this is uh, Matthew Robert Payne, and this is a personal prophecy for V. Uh, and uh, I'll just pray and dedicate this to the Lord. So, dear Father, I pray that uh, you give me a good word uh, for V, uh, a word to bless her, encourage her, and lift her spirits up. In Jesus' name I ask. Amen. I see... Um, I see an image of, of uh, a female uh, lion, which females uh, do most of the hunting. And she's crouching and she's getting ready to uh, uh, run and uh, catch a prey. And uh, it's an image of you. Um, I, I sense that... Um, uh, the Lord has got you in preparation uh, to go and do uh, great things for him. Um, I'm not sure what those things are, I haven't been told, but um, and, and this could be uh, an image of now or in the future. Uh, but uh, I, I, I sense that uh, the, the line is... Um, very fit and agile, and uh, I sense that um, that the Lord uh, he he is preparing you um, to be a witness uh, for Him, and um, and uh, the image of uh, of the lion uh, go and get prey. I, I sense that um, the Lord uh, wants you uh, to uh, read my book, uh, Prophetic Evangelism Made Simple. And I sense that uh, the Lord wants you to uh, read that and start to apply that and start to uh, prophesy uh, to strangers. Um, and uh, the Lord uh, will uh, make you fit and agile when it comes to spreading uh, encouragement uh, to strangers through uh, the prophecy of the Lord. Um, it'll be exciting and uh, and uh, different to uh, like the ferocious uh, aspect of of a lion uh, getting their prey. Um, uh, I, I sense that uh, you're going to. It, it's uh, it's like the lion, the lion when it's crouching, it picks out the weaker, uh, the weakest link uh, on on the bison or whatever it's looking at that it's going to attack. And uh, when you prophetically evangelize, um, the Lord has you look over an audience, and the Holy Spirit highlights one person uh, that uh, he. Um, uh, uh, the, the Lord highlights uh, one person that he wants you to uh, prophesy over and um, and um, and you go and prophesy over the person and it hits its mark it, it uh, really uh, does well and uh, it's the, it's the investigation of the line that allows it to get the weak uh, animal. Um, and uh, it's the leading of the Holy Spirit uh, with you as a person uh, that will allow you to find the people uh, that uh, you uh, prophesy over uh, with, uh, with accuracy. Um, I sense uh, Jesus uh, he's here and uh, he really wants to encourage you. Um, you're, um, you've been used um, a lot uh, in your life uh, to build people up and encourage people. Um, you really uh, love people. You've just got this uh, heart of Jesus where you just love people. You just love all sorts of people and uh, and. Uh, doing uh, prophetic evangelism is just encouragement. You just 
going up and encouraging people about gifts that are in them and uh, things about them that the Lord loves. And, uh, and so it's just a perfect, um, 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 perfect, uh, uh, Oh, sorry, someone's writing to me. Yeah, sorry about that. It's just a perfect uh, gift uh, for encouragement. Uh, the the Lord uh, leads me to people, and and I share. Uh, things in their personality that the Lord really loves about them, and uh, and and so for a person uh, like yourself who who likes to encourage people, it's just like an extra tool in your tool belt, and uh, it really encourages people. I, I really um, I'm led by the Lord to tell you this uh, in your prophecy, but uh, I'm really excited for you uh, that. Uh, that the Lord has chosen you uh, to to do this, and um, you can start out. Um, I uh, approach people and say, "Excuse me, I've got a gift," and from time to time, that gift allows me to have a message for a person. Uh, today, I've got a message for you, and um, and uh, then I just launch into the prophecy, um, and. Um, um, sorry, this person. Um, yes, yeah, sorry. Um, so um, the gift uh, allows you to uh, get a message for a person and, and uh, you encourage the person. And I use that simple line. Um, and uh, and um, when, when I use that line, people think like a clairvoyant or a psychic has walked up to them that they've got no idea that a Christian is just going to release a prophetic word over them and um, so it's a really good line to use but you could use a line uh, like saying um, I'm developing a gift um, at the moment and from time to time I, I get a message for a person today I've got a message for you um, can I practice and uh, if you ask some permission um, then uh, you can release a, a word and even if it's wrong uh, you know, at least you're practicing, um, but it won't be wrong. Uh, so I sense that uh, the Lord uh, really wants to encourage you into that gift. And uh, this is, um, this uh, in the prophecy is called a word of wisdom. It's like a direction from the Lord. So the Lord will um, uh, teach you uh, through my book and, uh, and bless you um, uh, through the book and uh, launch you into ministry and equip you uh, to do the work. Um, so uh, the Lord uh, is uh, very happy uh, with, um, with uh, your uh, gift of encouragement and, uh, and uh, that you've uh, encouraged uh, many people uh, in your life and you may not be aware that you have uh, the gift of encouragement. You, you may not be uh, really aware that you have that gift. You, you just uh, love people and you love to um, uh, sing their praises and uh, encourage them and bless them. And, uh, and yet now that you know you have the gift, you can sort of ratchet it up. You can wind it up and... Uh, um, when you have the gift of encouragement, uh, you um, have uh, you, you're very observant. You you 
you know when the girl at work has has got a new dress on and uh, you're able to say that's a really nice dress is that the first time you've worn it and she could have had it in her closet for a year and never worn it to work before and um, and you saying it's a nice dress will get her to rotate that dress and start wearing it to work um, and you're always encouraging people and Jesus uh, when you get to know him uh, he's really encouraging um, he doesn't point out your faults um, uh, you may have a whole lot of faults and Jesus doesn't press you on it and uh, doesn't remind you of your faults but he always encourages you in in the good things that you're doing he always uh, spurs you on and encourages you and um, you're such a, a encouraging person and uh, Jesus uh, really uh, loves you so I'm going to pray uh, for two things I, I'll pray uh, that uh, the Lord would uh, uh, start to give you prophetic words already uh, he would uh, give you uh, the three gifts of prophecy Lord I pray that you give me uh, the three gifts of prophecy prophecy uh, word of knowledge and word of wisdom I pray that you would start to lay on a heart messages for people and she'd be able to approach people and tell people the messages and the people would uh, be able to give her feedback so that she knows that she's right I pray also that uh, you uh, let her understand that she's got a, a spirit of encouragement, a gift of encouragement. And uh, I pray that there be a royal, a royal increase in that gift in her life and she become a lot more um, observant and uh, be able to wind that gift up and uh, be able to exercise that gift more frequently. I pray also that uh, there be an increase in the fruit of the spirit in her life love joy peace patience goodness kindness self-control that the fruit in the spirit the fruit of the fruit of the spirit may uh, develop in her life and uh, she become uh, a whole lot more beautiful uh, person uh, to uh, reflect uh, the light of christ in jesus name i ask amen uh, so I pray that that uh, would uh, manifest uh, in your life, uh, the gift of prophecy, uh, the gift of encouragement and the fruit of the spirit. And uh, I, I decree and declare that those things will come to pass in Jesus' name. Uh, amen. Um, I sense that uh, Jesus uh, really uh, wants to tell you uh, that he's proud of you, that uh, he's... Uh, He's uh, looking down upon your life and uh, he, he, he's smiling. Uh, I sense him uh, really smiling. Uh, he's proud of uh, the good work that you do. Um, uh, you, you, um, you don't know a whole lot, uh, just like uh, me. Uh, you don't know a whole lot about uh, scripture verses and theology and uh, deep things of, of, of the spirit of God. Um, but um, you, uh, you, you've got this uh, happy-go-lucky sort of personality. You, you, you always seem to be happy. You see the light side of life and, uh, and uh, you, you're not particularly deep or thorough, thoroughly equipped uh, with knowledge, uh, but uh, you're a light-hearted person and, and a fun person and a loving person. And... Uh, and uh, you really encourage people and uh, you're a real friend to people. And Jesus, uh, Jesus really loves you, you know, you, you're real comfort. You're a comfort to him. He enjoys uh, your prayers. Uh, he enjoys uh, hearing your worship. He, he enjoys you talking to him. Um, he uh, really enjoys you. Um, you, uh, you make him happy. Sometimes you make him laugh with your antics and the things that you do, you, you like to laugh yourself and he laughs along with your jokes. Uh, he really enjoys you and, and he really loves you and uh, he loves you for all the right reasons. And there's so many uh, aspects to you. Um, uh, I was wrong when I said you, you weren't deep. You're quite a deep person. You're a deep thinker. Um, but um, uh, one thing about you is uh, you don't think yourself uh, very special. You don't 
put yourself on a pedestal and think that uh, you're important or you're anyone great. And, uh, and um, Jesus uh, really uh, adores you and he really loves you. And, uh, and uh, uh, he wants you to know uh, that uh, he's uh, so happy with you and, uh, and he's got good things planned for you. And uh, uh, he, he tells me to tell you that uh, you've been promised things in prophecy before and uh, you've got dreams and desires. And he tells me to tell you not to give up on your dreams and desires and not to give up on the promises that have been made to you through prophecy. And, uh, and in time and in good time and in the right season, things will manifest. And uh, he's uh, really, uh, really uh, happy with you. He really uh, loves you. And uh, he, um, he looks forward to hearing from you. Um, you can, um, you can uh, thank him for this prophetic word and uh, have a conversation with him and uh, talk it over with him. And uh, I encourage you to uh, um, buy the book Prophetic Evangelism Made Simple. And uh, at the end of the book, there's a chance to prophesy over me and you can practice uh, prophesying over me. Um, I pray that this has uh, really blessed you. I, I look forward to your feedback. God bless.